Hello, everyone. We're so honored to be with you tonight and to be part of Chicago Shakespeare's season. This theater has long held a very special place in our family's hearts. My favorite thing about working at Chicago Shakespeare is the incredible group of friends with whom I've had the pleasure to work both on stage and off. From constantly trying to contain laughter during a comedy of airs to standing in the curtain call at the end of Follies, surrounded by all these incredible performers, it truly is a special place. One of my favorite memories of working with Barb was in the 1989 production of Cymbeline when the character of Jupiter, played by the late great Johnny Lee Davenport, came rolling out on a huge throne. We were all backstage and I looked around to see all of these great actors pumping fog and pushing that throne out. I knew this was family. And sure enough, many of those same folks, including Barb, have been some of my dearest friends ever since. We now have the distinct pleasure of introducing an exceptionally talented and award-winning performer who just happens to be our wonderful daughter, Lucy Godinez. And because tonight we are celebrating the ways in which we can keep the spark of creation alive, even when our theater is dark and we cannot be together in person, she will be performing The Spark of Creation from Stephen Schwartz's The Children of Eden. on the tip of my fingers I've got a boiling in the back of my brain I've got a hunger burning inside me cannot be denied I've got a feeling that the father who made us when he was kindling the pulse in my veins he left a tiny spark of that fire smoldering inside the spark of creation is flickering within me the spark of creation blazing in my blood a bit of the fire that lit up the stars and breathed life into the mud the first inspiration the spark of creation I see a mountain and I want to climb it I see a river and I want to leave shore where there was nothing let there be something something made by me there's things waiting for me to invent them There's worlds waiting for me to explore I am an echo of the eternal cry of Let there be the spark of creation Is burning bright within me The spark of creation Won't let me rest at all Until I discover nor build or uncover The thing that I can call Spark of creation, the spark of creation, may it burn forever, the spark of creation, I am a keeper of the flame, we think all we want is a lifetime of leisure, each perfect day the same, endless vacation. Well, that's all right if you're a kind of crustacean, but when you're born with an imagination, so 